Um, remaining legislative items we have today, um, I want to recognize Senator Tester for his comments on Senate Bill 524. Um, th this is a, a, a Native Hawaiian bill um, that um, uh, will work. Um, you're going to have to give me the comments. On oh, it's the advisory committee. I'm sorry. Um, I wasn't prepared to talk, which is unusual. Uh, it, sets up, it's, it sets up an advisory committee for Native, uh, Native Hawaiians uh, to make sure that Native Hawaiian veterans uh, are included in the conversation uh, on... Uh, on health care. Uh, Maisie, uh, can I refer to yes. Maisie? Cause this Thank you so much to um, uh, Chair Moran and Ranking Member Tester for focusing on this bill. And it does set up a, a Veterans Affairs Tribal Advisory Committee. And I would like to support the amendment Sorry. to this bill that would enable Native Hawaiians to be eligible to serve on the advisory committee as established by this bill. And uh, I understand that we've been working with you on the, on the language. And I mean, it is very important that Native Hawaiians are represented because we're talking about representation on this advisory committee of basically Native peoples. And uh, uh, Native Hawaiians are definitely Native peoples because they were there long before Captain Cook ever showed his face. So. Uh, thank you, Senator. Amendment. Thank you. Uh, the, the bill we're talking about is Senate Bill 524. It is the Tester Sullivan Cinema Kramer Bill to create a, uh, within the Department of Veterans Affairs a Tribal Advisory Committee Act of 2019. Uh, and while Senator Tester didn't have anything to say about it, uh, Senator Hirono did, and now Senator Sinema does as well. Thank you. First of all, Mr. Chairman, congratulations. Um, and it's an honor to serve on this committee with you, and I'm looking forward to more bipartisan work together. Thank you. Um, I, I'm really grateful that we're moving forward on the Department of Veteran Affairs Tribal Advisory Committee Act. Um, I'm, as you know, a co-sponsor of the bill. Arizona is home to 22 federally recognized tribes and houses the third largest population of Native Americans in the country. So it's critical that we address the unique challenges that Native Americans face in accessing VA services. Native Americans serve in our military at a higher rate than any other ethnic group, and our bipartisan bill strengthens the voices of Native veterans and ensures that they receive the benefits they've earned. And of course, we must continue to support tribal communities by making sure that Native American veterans have access to the VA healthcare benefits they've earned. So thank you, members, for considering this bill, and Mr. Chair, I yield back. Thank you, Senator Sinema. The uh, next, uh, Mr. Uh, Chairman. Uh, Senator from Alaska. Uh, Mr. Chair, I just want to um, comment on what Senator Sinema mentioned. I think it's a really, really important point that we as senators, as Americans, recognize this, what I refer to back in my state as special patriotism of our Alaska Native or Native Hawaiian or Native American populations that, let's face it, these are communities that have not always been treated well by their own federal government, sometimes horribly by their own federal government, and yet year after year, generation after generation, war after war, they serve at higher rates in the military than any other ethnic group in the country. It's unbelievable, it's remarkable. And the more we can do to highlight that and thank the people in our Native American or Native Alaskan or Native Hawaiian communities on this special patriotism, the better, which is why I was, a one of the original authors of this legislation, and I think it deserves strong bipartisan support. Uh, thank you, Senator. Uh, we are now going to consider this and uh, other legislation. It's items uh, three through 10. We've already dealt with S850. The remaining bills that are on the agenda in bonk, and I would uh, ask if there's a motion that they be reported favorably. So moved by the Senator from North Carolina, Senator Tillis. Second. Seconded by Senator Blumenthal. Is there discussion? All those in favor of the en banc motion to report those bills favorably, uh, please say aye. 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 Opposed, no. Ayes appear to have it. Ayes do have it. The bills will be reported favorably. 